good morning. Just wanted to let all y'all know. Well, these are my new calla lilies. Aren't they pretty? I found out I can bring them inside the house too. Anyway, so I got some new flowers. And I've got to say, y'all, my hydrangea, good lord, look what happened to her. <laughs> she was pretty blue and all colorful. This one here, she's just hanging on for dear life. Look at that. <laughs> anyway, pray for my flowers. I'm going to talk to them. Anyway, I just wanted to say that my new medication is working quite well. Much better than I expected. Um... I haven't, I found one really great strain that gave me energy like I haven't had in years, but it wasn't a crazy energy like I couldn't stop. It was just a good energy like finally I had the strength to pick up some stuff and, you know, do what I could. And I cleaned my side of the bed in 15 minutes, which is a miracle because normally I can't do that. So... I just want to say anybody against the use of medicinal marijuana legally um, you might want to think about it before you judge because it is a beautiful thing when it's when it works and I gotta say the strains I've found uh, so far have been quite amazing the one I found that gave me a lot of energy and uh, I've found a couple for PTSD and the anxiety that I have. And I'm hoping to get off now four medications. Uh, I only took a third of my pain medicine yesterday. That's a miracle. Right there. That should speak volumes. A third. So, that's huge. Let's see if I can do it again today. I'm not going to push myself because... I'm not playing the medications I'm on. There's nothing to play with, so I'm just going to do what I can. But anyway, I know this is long. I just wanted to say that the medicinal marijuana laws now are, in Florida anyway, seem to be working. And it's not hard to get your license. It's very easy. And if you find the right doctor, you only have to pay like 150 I found a bunch that were 300 but if you look hard enough, you'll find a doctor around Florida that is cheaper than the other doctors in Ocala. Like, I, that's who I was going to go to, is Ocala doctors. I was all set to go to them, and then I found out that the Ocala doctor is, much, is twice as expensive, if not more, than the one in Crystal River, Dr. Redrick. So I highly recommend Dr. Redrick in Crystal River. Have a God-filled day. And remember to love your neighbors and don't judge their neighbors. Don't judge. Just love. Be respectful. See you soon.